Whoa! One fight. <laughs> Hello, my name is Mr. Random and welcome to Patrick's Revenge. Another SpongeBob horror game. Look at Patrick! He just popped around the corner, the crusty crap. Because we've not done horror games of SpongeBob on this channel, have we? Okay. Okay. Oh, oh my. <laughs> Patrick, are you not concerned about the cannibal? No! <laughs> oh no, I die. We, we love a good old SpongeBob horror, but yeah. Straight into the Krusty Krab. I had to play this. I seen there was a SpongeBob horror game, and I have to play it. It is like an unhealthy obsession it with this channel. It was a regular night at Krusty Krab. <laughs> Love the AI voice. I just voice. finished my shift and was on my way home. <laughs> do, 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 do. I think we're playing as Squidward on this one. So Squidward's not the killer for once, which is nice. Then again, we've had a Squidward killer, we've had a SpongeBob killer, so it's nice to have a Patrick killer. I can't even imagine what would happen next. Oh, neither could I, because I have no idea what I'm in for. That's normal with most of these sponge drop games. Oh, can I drive? No, I can't, but I can look around. Leaving Krusty Krab, leaving work. I worked a nine to five that shift. It went dark kind of early because it's winter. The flowers in the sky give me hope for a brighter summer. To be fair, you don't live that far from work. That's pretty all right, that. That's pretty, it's not too far. It's not a bad driving, huh? Am I driving now? Wait, why would I get... I come back up. Why would I park so far away from my house? Like, wouldn't, I just, wouldn't it make more sense to park right near the house instead? What's the bus doing out in the middle of the open? Okay, so... My plan is just to go home. Okay. I come back home. Damn! I think I lost my house keys. Oh, they're probably at the Krusty Krab. Them. They're probably at the Krusty Krab then, aren't they? Go back to my car and go back to work at the Krusty Krab because that's where I can only imagine I lost my key. Can't go back in the car. Well, that sucks. Where am I gonna find my keys? Around the back of my house? No. SpongeBob? You got my keys? Oh, that's interesting. I can't find the house keys anywhere. Is there anything down here? Can, can I walk away? Would my house keys be near the bus? Which I wouldn't expect it to be. What the hell were my keys doing here? The keys were there. Why are my keys on a barrel? It's a good question. Why are my house keys not with me? Why are they on a barrel? That's so bizarre. <laughs> oh, we love the SpongeBob horror games. They're so weird. I'm just looking around because I don't trust anything. Okay, where well, are we going in our house? What? Wait, wait, wait what's Patrick doing? What's Patrick doing? Patrick, go away! I'm stuck! Patrick, leave me alone! Ah! That was the shittest kidnapping ever! That was such a bad kidnapping! Why did Squidward not go in his house? And why wouldn't he let me move? Why did Squidward just stand there? Why was Patrick running so goofy towards me? Can I just leave? It feels like I'm. It feels like I'm in SpongeBob's house actually, instead of Patrick's. Wouldn't it make sense if Patrick was going to kidnap me to take me to his house? Oh, we look at that. There's a SpongeBob and Pat, SpongeBob and Plankton with the um, special spatula from that one episode. Um, I can't go in here. I'm guessing I need a keypad. It won't let me um, type anything. In, actually, okay. Well. This is it. Oh, oh. Would you rate that ass? Would you rate that cake? I'd rate it a 7.5 out of... 7.5 out of what the hell the hell is going on? Oh, the door just slammed in my face. SpongeBob, what's going on? SpongeBob, <laughs> what are you doing here? Squidward, you have finally arrived. And Squidward, you have finally arrived. And he has lost his mind and wants to kill us all. So a normal day in Bikini Bottom, right? And how do I save you now? Why would Don't I want to save him? The keys upstairs. Be careful. He is crazy. Okay, so Patrick is crazy. Remember, we avoid him. Okay, so I feel like I could just pull this open, or you know, oh look at that! You keep the you keep the um Krabby Mobile in here, the 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 Patty in here, the I forgot what it's called um in the movie. I know it's bad. I didn't even mean. I'm just exploring. I didn't even mean to. There's a giant red arrow though. Five six eight one two. So I'm guessing that's the password. Secret bookshelf? No, but it looks like it. I'm not gonna go upstairs because, you know, I got the passcode now. So it was, um, I forgot it. 
Uh, five. Five. Uh, five. <laughs> okay, well. Okay, I can't take this game seriously anymore after that. You can't just give me farting sounds for a password. I'm trying to take you seriously, game, that I'm not meant to take seriously. Oh my god! A screwdriver. What do I do with the TV? Can I unscrew it? I got a screwdriver. I know it says find the key upstairs, but I'm trying to collect my resources before I go upstairs. Because upstairs seems like a lot of stairs, realistically. Seems like a lot to go through. Oh, look at that. A jellyfish in it. And then we got sponge cipher over here. Um. Oh, hey, buddy! I was just looking for you! So it turns... Well, that was fucking... That was rude, wasn't it? I was trying to have a conversation. Okay. I was gonna say, who has the bed in the middle of the room like this? So weird. So bizarre. Ah, uh, look how best buddies they are. Um... I guess not for long. Okay, well, I got the screwdriver. So, does this give me light? That was, that, that was stored power. Oh, to up there. I thought it was gonna turn on some lights. I haven't even gone upstairs yet. Wait, wait, is upstairs blocked? Or was I supposed to be doing this? Cause honestly, I thought if I go upstairs, I would just die or something like that. And I was trying to do all the goofy stuff first because I know this game's not that long, but yep, the door's locked. Wow. So I've literally intentionally been doing what you're supposed to do. Sponge up, sponge up. Um, you look like cheese. Okay, well, I'm gonna continue doing what I'm supposed to be doing because, you know, I've had enough lollygagging around right now. Can I go sleep? Can I touch your alarm? No? This game's so rude. Like, I just wanted to... Can I get crushed? Do you think that... No, there's an invisible wall. Yeah, they thought about that. I was gonna say, like, I don't know. I don't know the boundaries of what I can get away with because this is a SpongeBob horror game. And half the time, they're ridiculous. And half the time, they're funny. And the 1% of time, the scary. So I can never take these games too serious. Oh, okay. Gary, how do I save Gary? I'm guessing I can't. Well, I'm still looking for a key. Find keys upstairs. Is Patrick a threat? Because I've not really seen much of threat. The most I've seen is him look at me with his red evil eyes. Okay. There's a key. Can I unlock the door from the side first? You know, just... No, I can't. I was gonna say, just in case a threat comes that way. I wanna be ready. Open this, open the gate, okay. I can open SpongeBob's gate. Patrick, Patrick, Gary, don't look at me like that. You're the scariest thing in this game so far. I can't jump. Oh my God, I've been defeated by my worst enemy, my legs. Squidward can't jump. I swear he's got like eight legs. Well, he's got, actually he's got four legs, hasn't he? On the shirt, I don't know, don't question me. Now I can move it. Oh, and then we set the stairs to go around, and then we unlock the cage. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, I don't know why. <laughs> I'm so ridiculous, Arda. Hey, SpongeBob, I got your key. Here you go. I'm, I'm trying to, there you go. Oh, we got SpongeBob out. This music slaps. Why is SpongeBob doing a ninja pose? What's going on there? Oh no, there's evil Patrick. Well, three. Oh, whoa! Two, whoa! One, fight! <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what is this Mortal Kombat showdown? <laughs> Come on, Squidward! Let's go! There he is! Champion! Kick his ass! I swear that didn't even touch the pure force of that leg move, and he's dead. KO! <laughs> Do not tell me. <laughs> that was the game! Oh my god! After the kidnapping of SpongeBob and Squidward, Patrick was sentenced to 10 years in prison, but he's dead! Unfortunately for him, the police have lost the key to his cell, and he will remain there for life. Oh. Well, that sucks. This music's a bop. Hopefully. Okay. Wow. This was a stupid game. <laughs> Thanks for playing. You're welcome. Okay. Well, you know, I was expecting it to be a lot more scary than that.
I can't lie. The Mortal Kombat segment really had me laughing. <laughs> I was expecting more from you, Patrick. At least Squidward and SpongeBob in their horror games actually posed a threat. You really are as dumb on the show as you are a murderer, aren't you? Or a killer, or a kidnapper. Oh, I didn't even know what you were attempting to do with Squidward. You kidnapped him and leave him at the front door. Anyway. I hope you enjoyed this video sat at home. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you are new around here. I upload Monday, Wednesday, Friday, every day at 6pm. So I hope to see you in my next video, and as always, bye!